Now I have with me the number one Bishop of Real Estate in the world, actually, Adeni Adeyemi. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is a special edition of the Investment Chat Show in a Rolls Royce. Usually you have Dr. Stevie Lakitanya, but it's his birthday special episode, and I'm the one hosting the show. So, sir, I met you through him, and honestly, you're a very inspirational person as well, but I'd like you to share with me what you found most inspirational about Dr. Stephen Akitayo? Ah, awesome. Thank you so much, Mama <laughs> TMO. <laughs> I, I would um, say that um, sincerely, um, um, it's always good to have the gift of men. Um, for me, I can say a few things about Dr. Stephen Akitayo because um, uh, there was something I saw in him that got me I'm so good to him looking at the number of years I've been around him and one of those things is the heart of doggedness mm. I saw someone who was dogged and who was willing to make it of course there's no way you'll be dogged that you will not make, make it, make it. Mm. so I, I saw somebody who will want to um, ignore any obstacle for the goal ahead of him. Mm. I saw um, someone um, who has a heart of gold. I mean, uh, even with nothing, he still want to be a blessing. You know, I uh, for me, even if the fisc I remembered many years ago when he had the. Um, um, a particular program in Abuja that uh, told me, he said, you know something, uh, MOG, you must come and speak at that event, but I don't have money, mm. even to take you there, but I want people to hear me, I want, I want people to know that there's somebody who understands th this thing called real estate. I said, okay, uh, but you know, it's a lot to fly down to Abuja and come back. He said, hey, I may not be able to pay you now, but there's something in the future. Mm. I said, okay. So he's willing to give, even if there is nothing. Have. So after being dogged, he's a, he's a, he has a golden heart. He wants to give charity. Yes, ma'am. So um, I, I, I saw someone who is a true friend. Mm. Um, you, you, you may not have a perfect person in me as a person. Neither in any other person, mm -hmm. but I saw a true friend. Well, back with another person who's going to share his experience with Dr. Stephen Akita. You're celebrating him for his birthday because this is a special edition of the investment chat show in the Rolls Royce. And I have with me Izu Woma. Izu, good to have you. Izu is fire branded, he's one of the consultants that I've met through GTEXT. And what would you say has been your experience since meeting Stephen Akitayo and how have you changed from knowing him? Yeah, absolutely. Um, I think he's one of the very strategic people with making decisions, very long term thinking, very visionary. And I think one key value I see him do is do more with less. Right? He's the kind of person who understands strategic partnerships, understands that none of us is as smart as all of us. So he's all looking for ways to collaborate and he's such a great magnet for talent. He's mm -hmm. less very good people. He's the person who takes off right from an airplane and then figures out on the way down how not to fall down, right? So it's sort of like a moving parachute. He's the kind of person who, in practical terms, right, he doesn't have to wait for everything perfect. He has a great idea, he starts it, and then the tools he needs to be found on the way, right? And I think that's really important in itself, right? He's just a visionary person, he doesn't understand the concept called no, 
Mm. Right. So you know it's not something you hear him say. Hmm. Impossible is not something you hear him say. And I think that's really powerful in hmm. itself. You know, he's um there's just a lot to learn. And and genuinely I think that just the personality of who you are comes in the way, right? If you take out all that sophistication and all that, what you generally see when you unveil that it's a very good and nice person and someone that has humanity in the middle of everything else, right? That's because sometimes we get too busy and forget the fundamental role as human beings to be humans to people respect to what they have it's the kind of person understand that it's not what you don't have that stops you mm. right it's what you have and don't know how to use mm. right so we're back to caution about doing more mm. less <coughs> oh wow that's a powerful i don't even need to ask you more questions <laughs> um what's your wishes what would you want to say to him when he sees this on his birthday in all honesty i, I think that he has very big dreams mm. big dreams and i want to see all of those dreams become reality right i want him to move from well said Mm. to well done right he said a lot of great ideas and uh, it's, it's not just even about him right um he's not the kind of person that's asking what's in it for me right he's the kind of person that asks what's in me for it mm. and i want to see him reach those goals Be i want all. him to touch all of his visions mm. all of his objectives i want him to wake up one morning and realize that all that he wished for is something that he achieved oh, that's happy so birthday mr steven <laughs> GTEx Home is a brand with vision of having the largest green and smart estate with innovation and technology. The vision has given birth to Jasper Gardenia along the coastline of Ibejuleki, Lagos. The first green and smart affordable estate. Now, Jasper Estate is just 10 minutes away from Dangote Refinery and is just opposite the Lekki Golf Course. And guess what? The title is Gizek. Now, with 17 million naira, you can get a property here. Yes. And you can also make a down payment of 5 million naira. And you can choose not to pay it at one go. There is a stretch of 24 months payment. So, what that means is that you have two years to pay for the property. So, it is pertinent. You are part of what is going on here because here, my friend, is the future. We are going to do the equipment for uh, the right uh, at the right time to the right people, and uh, I'm sure everybody that benefits is God that rewards. So he has done it secretly. God will reward him openly and otherwise. So we are taking a very beautiful birthday to him, long life and prosperity. Thank you for coming. Strength. As I keep helping of all organizations, so shall the Lord uplift you. You will not go down, you will not lack. Text Homes, a subsidiary of GTEx Global, brought to you by Stephen McIntyre. And is bringing you Jasper Estate. 
it is located along the urban area of Ibeju Lake in Lagos, Nigeria. <laughs> this is just luxury at the tip of your fingers, which is 12 minutes drive from the Dlaka Pine Tropicana. It's 15 minutes from Dangote Refinery. And it's 5 minutes to Lekki Town. 2 minutes from Stone Beach Resort. It is just adjacent to the Dangote Jetty. And if you're one that likes to travel down memory lane and be in tune with the relics, Awolo Museum is 5 minutes away. It is barely 11 minutes from Lekki Deep Sea Port. Pick up that phone, dial that number, send that WhatsApp message to the number on your screen and secure your slot today. Also available in Abuja and 20% discount also apply. Hello guys, welcome to another episode of 360 Seconds um, in a Rolls Royce with Steven Akin Tayo. Okay, it takes over 44,000 color palettes um, to make a Rolls Royce, more than that actually, and no Rolls Royce color is the same like if you want a particular color that of a particular rose royce that you've seen you actually have to go to the owner and take permission to use that particular type and the reason for me giving you all these long stories <laughs> is because if you will build lasting wealth you have to be original a lot of time we're busy trying to be somebody else and listen to me, the truth remains. You have to copy someone else. Yes, you heard me. You have to copy someone. But there's something called copyright. In copying someone, you have to look for how to make it your own. Um, money is a function of joy, of um, pleasure. Wealth is a function, whatever gives you pleasure, lies, there lies your wealth, there lies your money. And so you have to find a way to build originality in that which you do. When I started business, I was with a buck SMS business. I started with a thousand era. And we, there was no anti-spam law then. I was able to leverage on that to start selling data, phone number, email database. And I c will never forget that even though I started with SMS, later I had to figure out that the, my opportunity wasn't in the SMS itself, but was in getting large database and being the leader in database. Because when you get database, then you will then need to buy SMS unit to be able to use to send the email, SMS as well as the email campaigns that you need to send to get new customers. And as I focused on that, again, there was nothing new about owning a book SMS business, but I became the leader in sales of database that became what was used to push SMS campaign. And that was how I did my first 100 million. You want to be wealthy, look into what you're doing right now, your business, your concept, even your place of work. How can you be original? How can you bring something, okay, that nobody else can bring to the table? Or how can you perfect on something that is good and then add your own uniqueness. Listen, there are over uh, 200 million spam cells that competed when you were born. They ran a race. And out of 200 million spam cells, you won. What is that telling us? You were born original, you were born authentic, and you were born you. And you were born powerful. So, harness all that and begin to use that to your advantage. Find a way to be original and sell yourself as original and perfect your originality and see how money begins to chase you. Because remember, money doesn't chase copycat. Money chases originality. I'm Stephen Akintayo, Africa's most sought after investment coach, story entrepreneur, even though it's raining, but I had to bring this to you. I hope you enjoyed it. Follow me across all social media platforms and shoot me a testimony about how this video has added value to you. I love you. God bless you. Bye-bye.
G Text Homes, a subsidiary of G Text Global, brought to you by Stephen McIntyre, and is bringing you Jasper Estate. It is located along the urban area of Ibeju Lake, Lagos, Nigeria. <laughs> this is just luxury at the tip of your fingers, which is 12 minutes drive from the Dlaka Pine Tropicana. It's 15 minutes from Dangote Refinery. And it's 5 minutes to Lekki Town. 2 minutes from Stone Beach for so. It is just adjacent to the Dangote Jetty. And if you're one that likes to travel down memory lane and be in tune with the relics, a Wallow Museum is 5 minutes away. It is barely 11 minutes from Lekki Deep Sea Port. Pick up that phone, dial that number, send that WhatsApp message to the number on your screen and secure your slot today. Also available in Abuja and 20% discount also apply. Steven Akitsayo, you are just a wonderful man. May Almighty Allah bless your new age. You shall live long to eat the fruits of your labor. Me only why eat it like barrel long. And you know, only why what you a shop or look or don't like you know, land like Jerry for Combale, let him a she a dagba, any dagba or she a any for just so cool you. You know the new Wawati. I shed Jerry, I shed Low Low. I bless the day that I met you. You are just a wonderful man. I wish you long life and prosperity. Hip, hip, hip. Hooray! Enjoy your day. Bye. I remember being with Stephen about three years ago at an event that we spoke at uh, here in the United States. And I was immediately captivated by Stephen. I mean, his ability to inspire the audience, to motivate and to really take them from where they are to where they should be. Um, that really captivated my attention. And that day that I first met him, I went home and started watching all his videos. I mean, up until 1 a.m. in the morning. And I discovered at that point that he had written about 30 something books and that really changed my perspective about Steven, you know? And I, I reached out to him, hey, how did you do it? What did you do? You know, and from my from that experience and that that brief um, introduction as to how to become an author, I've written four books of my own up until today. Okay, and that was as a direct result of meeting Stephen and learning from him. You know, even though we're around the same age, I mean, to me, he's like the boss. You know, and I respect him so much. So thank you so much, Stephen, for the impact that you've made in my life over the past three years. Thank you for the impact that you've made in other people's lives in helping them to become a better version of themselves. And I look forward to our relationship to continue to grow um, over the next several years, decades to come. All right, once again, happy birthday. 
and keep soaring like an eagle. Uh, some years ago, I was privileged to serve in your company and I learned digital marketing and that prompted my business to move from where it was not even relevant to, to the place of relevance. You're not just a blessing as a leader, you are called and backed up with grace to be a blessing to a lot of people around the world. I want to say God bless you. I want to say long life and prosperity in 10, in 20, in 30, in 40, in 50 years to come. You shall be more stronger and your family will not be missing. None will be broken in the name of Jesus. Thank you so much, Dr. Stephen Akintaya, for who you are and for what you do. I want to wish you happy birthday one more time. And we love you from my, from my family, all my businesses. We celebrate you with the staff. God bless you. Cheers. I want to say a happy, happy, happy birthday to Dr. Stephen Akintayo. I also want to thank you for playing a pivotal role and being an awesome mentor in my business success. You inspire me to work hard and dream big. When you strongly desire something, God sends someone as a medium to help you in achieving that which you desire. And in my case, that person is you. Dr. Stephen. It is because of your guidance during the peak of the um, pandemic that Soteria Specialties Limited has experienced a major break. That singular meeting with you has shifted us. I tell you, sir, we have blown. Thank you so much for your constant pushing and advice. Thank you so much for constantly nudging me to become the best I can be. Every session with you leaves me pumped up and fired up. Thank you so much for constantly supporting the Soteria clothing brand. I cannot count my success in business without counting you. Thank you, Dr. Stephen Akintayo. I want to pray for you today that God will bless you and continually increase your sphere of influence. You think you have been blessed? Hold on, you ain't seen nothing yet. God is going to surprise you beyond your expectation. Thank you for all you do. Thank you for impacting this generation. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. God bless you. God keep you and your family. Happy, happy, happy birthday, sir. When I met Dr. Stephen McIntyre a few years ago, I want to say one of the first things that he impacted my life in the area that he impacted my life would be in the area of my knowledge of who I am, personality-wise. He taught me so much about uh, my personality as a sanguine, and he would always laugh at me and say, huh? sanguine. You know, so he's such a dynamic person, so such so full of wisdom, knowledge, always studying, always researching, always exploring. My God, he can explore. So I thank God for who he is. I thank God for his dynamic vision. I thank God for who God has made you to be. Thank you for the words of wisdom. Thank you for always being there for me when I call you. When I call you to tell you all my problems and you'll be telling me what to do. I thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you for whipping me into shape whenever I needed a whipping. Thank you for encouraging me when I needed encouraging. Thank you for giving me advice when I needed advice. Thank you for helping me to save myself from a lot of things. And I thank you for all your books, particularly this one. This book right here is called The Millionaire Blogger because that's who he's gonna try to make me to be. And so I like the book so much. Um, it talks about the secret behind successful blog site and how to create one. So small book but a powerful one get his books and bless him on this day just go out and bless him bless him buy his books buy his coaching and just you know celebrate who he is and who god has called him to be to help people so pastor stephen i pray for you i pray for you that all your visions concerning you know all your dreams and aspirations that god will help you to bring them to pass that you will move from minimum to maximum that you will accomplish all the great things that your heart desires and i thank you i thank you family i thank you for all that you do i thank you for your sacrifice thank Thank you for your labor. Thank you for your wisdom. God bless you. Enjoy your day. I'm Shay Hopewell. And you know I love you.